Hey everybody, back with a short version or short video of the roundup of the case of Ultimate Masters. So we're off the bat as far as mythics go. So I got Ulamog in both the extended art foil, regular, and Miracle, same thing. Temporal manip manipulation in the uh, extended art foil and a regular one in foil. Liliana, Kozilek, two Snapcaster Mages, Micaeus, Karn, Dark Depths. We got Uborg in both the foil and the regular. Phyrexian Tower, Demonic Tutor, two Ancient Tomes. Three, sorry, three regular Noble Hierarchs and a foil Noble Hierarch. Two Fauna Shamans, three Gambles, a foil Entomb and a regular Entomb. Reanimate, two Glen Alendra Archmage. Two All is Dust, two <laughs> a Lousy Constriction. It just keeps going on and on. Life and Alone, Flagstones, Detroit Care. Um, three, four, six Berries Alive, five Eternal Witnesses, including Foils. So box one came in at about $453 on MTG Low. Uh, the Rares killed it in that particular box and went even higher than I expected it to. The um, box two, yeah, box two was awful. $271. Box three actually uh, was better than I thought it was going to be. It ended up at 355, which just was a solid box. And then box four at 403. So that was a grand total of 1482 on MTG low versus the uh, 332 I paid per box here, the $1,328. So overall, that case was, uh, while it didn't kill it, it was a success. Got some really awesome cards out of it. I feel like this is the way to open these. Uh, you do get the best mix of the of the cards in the set, um, and you mitigate your risk of opening a single bum box like box two was for me. All right, well, until next time, thanks for watching. Bye.